Morning from Scotland again. Day three, four, five. I can't remember. Might even be fifty-five. I'm on my way up to a, a little-known mountain called Ben Yavuni, which is actually a Graham status. So it's um, 692 meters, and it just sits southeast of Sleok, the big Munro. So I had a look at it this morning on that, and thought, yeah, it looks good as that. I'll go and have a look at it. So. I'm going to do a clockwise walk, okay, get going. It's not a bad day. Good views over there to Ben here. Um, I follow this slee up path for probably about maybe a couple of miles and then I'll cut off east up to this Graham and uh, hopefully I'll get some good views, okay. So about half a mile into the walk, I came across a bridge that crosses over the Kinloch U River. This river feeds from Loch Marie. Path starting to climb now. It's, um, sun's out over there now. What a view that is! Over to Ben Air na um, Nature Reserve. Over there's a Corbett, and I think there's one at the back. Yeah, there is, well there is one at the back, but it's in Clag. You can't see it. Okay, start climbing. Just hit the river now uh, that goes into Loch Marie. So it's, I'm still on this uh, slee up path and before I cut off. Okay, meadow break from the uh, slee up path. I'm going to climb up there and ride up. So, to that for a view down to Loch Marie and Sleok. Okay, better go and get stuck in. Forget your pathless terrain. This is unbelievably steep. Moan, moan, moan. But I'll tell you what, it's worth it for views like that of Loch Marie. Wow, look at that. Sharp shock that were. <sighs> now even though I got over the sharp sharp shock, I knew there was still some more uphill to go before I get to the trick point. It's getting blowy up here. There we go, it's up there. The back of there's the uh, trick point. So I'm gonna follow along here this sort of like a deer path. Okay. So after having a nice lunch of cucumber sandwiches and jelly and ice cream for afters, well not jelly, I decided to pick up a burn and follow it up. Sun's coming out now, give you a bit of a boost. Yeah, I'm no twitcher, but isn't that a white tailed eagle? It looks like one. It looks like it's been feeding on a deer down in the bottom. So that's why that eagle were kicking about there, look. It's dead stag. Okay, up there now, one big push up there. 
Now leaving the locking behind, I turned round to look at the stunning views that were opening up behind me. One last push up there. Whew. Tough. So I'm finally up. Sorry I'm shouting. This is a false summit. The main summit's over there in the distance. So I'll go and get over there. Just a quick look over to the fisher field. And Ann Chillac in the gap. Ann Chillac with the pinnacles. Can you see him? Stunning views. And with the clouds pushing over and the fantastic views over the Sleek, I finally made the trick point of Ben Yerbuni. Okay, before I go, let me show you what I can see. So first we've got up looking over to northwest is Sleok. And over there to the west is the sun setting over Torridon and Ben A. And back over to the north again to the Fisher Field and the Monroe Mountains. And after another 10 minutes of admiring the views, I knew it was time to leave before it went dark. So I've just left the trick point behind and it's really cold now. So I'm going to cut east and pick my way down and find a different way back. Okay, get going. After dropping a couple of hundred metres and seeing the terrain below, I thought, have I made the right decision going through all that bog? Looks like we got some rain coming over to the west. Oh, I thought we were going to have a day with no rain today. Ah oh well, better get the waterproofs on. So I'm finally down, but it looks like I'm going to have to cross this burn. There's no way I'm going to get down that right hand side. So I'll go and look and see if I can cross. So I'm finally getting down now. Back down onto the path over there. The weather's coming in again. So I'll say again, thanks for watching. And I hope you've uh, enjoyed coming along with us on this one. It's been a, another good day. I'll leave you with a view of Loch Marie over there as it's starting to go dark. Okay, ready for some tea and a cup of coffee. Okay, thanks again for watching and I'll hopefully see you on the next one.